because he stinks in the power play. He stinks. John Tortorella is one of the more famous coaches in hockey. You might remember some of his famous sound bites where he is brutally honest about his team, verbally challenging reporters, or defending his team. You play hard. When we play like like that for 20 minutes, in a game like this, in a back-to-back -back situation, it's unacceptable. This is gonna be really quick. I'm not taking any questions. We sucked from head to toe, and we need to move by it. I guess that's what I'm saying, Brooksy. You get that through your head? I guess so. Yeah. I mean, it's time to waste the time. Well, then get the f out of here, then. Okay, see ya. John Tortorella might seem like a hard-nosed coach who only cares about winning, but I think there is more to John Tortorella. Sure, he is a coach who has high expectations for his players and will be hard on them, but I think it comes from a love of the game. We occasionally get to see John's big heart for the game of hockey and everyone involved. One of these moments happened on September 23rd, 2024, and it involves the father of a former player. Johnny and Matthew Goodrow were tragically killed by a drunk driver over the summer. It devastated the hockey community. John Tortorella invited Goodrow's father, Guy Goodrow, to a Flyers practice. Tortorella explains his reasoning in a post-practice interview. Uh, yeah, behind it is I, I called him uh, and I wanted to know if we want to come out. Uh, um, it, it's pretty close to home here as far as with his family and all and what's gone on there. Um, he's a coach. I've, first time I met him was today. He was hesitant at first and we kind of let him go at his timetable and uh, I, think, I, I think it worked out really well today. I gave him my camp book. Uh, we're gonna check in next week and, and see if we can get him out here a couple more times. And well, I don't know. He he, he was giving me shit that I was yelling at the players to, to skate harder. He says you only have three lines out here. How how much harder can they go? And uh, so he's paying attention. So it was good. A little known fact about John is that he runs various charities with his wife, and one of those charities is called Bears Angels. The organization is named after John's beloved late dog, and they support local shelters and programs for animals. During the NHL season, we might see clips of Tortorella's unique coaching style, but at the end of the day, you cannot deny this man has a huge heart for the game and his community.